Shadow Mewtwo will be used today in the Go Battle League in the Master League. As Master League is back again. So we're going to see how this crazy Mewtwo performs as it is definitely way stronger than the non-shadow form. However, yep, I'm going to show you guys the IV. It's not a Hundo, but it's still definitely way better than a Hundo Mewtwo. Alright, so hi, hi to all of you guys. So when I say that it's actually better than a non-shadow uh, Hundo Mewtwo, it means that actually it dishes out more damage. However, you know, it suffers more damage at the same time. So um, according to PV Poke, actually a Shadow Mewtwo is not as good, but uh, we're going to see how it works. And um, it's actually maxed up to level 50 already. And it has the fast move Psycho Card, Charge Move, Side Strike and Shadow Boy, Elite Charge TM for everything except the fast move. So it's a very very expensive investment. <laughs> so um, let's go ahead to use it in the Master League to see how this uh, crazy Pokemon performs. So this is the team I'll be using with with uh, Giratina and also Dialga running the same old move sets. All right, Dialga running Dragon Breath, Iron Tail, and also Draco Meteor. Wow, Giratina is running Shadow Claw, Ominous Wind, and also Shadow Ball. So we got matched up against our very first opponent, HK45. C and let's see what he has. He has a Mewtwo with him. Everybody's gonna use Mewtwo, I guess. All right, so let's see um, how's he gonna handle my uh, DL gear. If he has Focus Blast, that would be very, very bad for me. But I'm um, looking at the situation. All right, all right. He's charging up to Focus Blast already. Uh, does he have Focus Blast? I did not come. So sorry, but I'm gonna shoot. Okay, my Iron Head is also ready, and it is Focus Blast. Luckily, I shielded that. Otherwise, uh, my uh, the Elgar is going to go bye-bye, so um, let's go ahead to use our very first charge move, Iron Head. Alright, I might have to double shield against the Mewtwo because uh, Mewtwo's Focus Blast is going to one-shot my Dialga. Alright, if goes unshielded, but I'm thinking if I want to try and catch the uh, Focus Blast. Okay, on the Giratina. Okay, I caught, I caught the Focus Blast. Let's uh, see that. Okay, that's good. I could have actually... Uh, Catch it using the Mewtwo, also it's totally fine, whichever is fine, but you guys can see that it did a little bit less damage, but um, of course the DL gear coming in right now, it's not really good for us, but we're going to go with our Shadow Blo- Blaw, Shadow Blaw, oh, what's wrong with my, my mouth? Shadow Blaw, oh wow, Shadow Blaw, <laughs> alright, mixed up the A and the L, Shadow Blaw, B-L-A-W, uh, don't know, I don't know how, know how to spell Shadow Blaw, alright, you guys can let me know, man. Alright, so anyway, I'm going to bring back uh, the Algear again after my Giratina goes down to farm down the Dialgear. Alright, and uh, here we go, man. We're going to bring back the Dialgear, farm down the Dialgear, and also uh, the Mewtwo is still at full health, which is really good for us. Okay, bring it in ho -Oh. I'm going to charge up a bit more energy first. Okay, good. Draco Meteor goes in. Let's see if he's going to shield this or not. Alright, and then I'm going to bring in my Mewtwo. Alright, right after that goes through. Okay, well, he decided to not shield that. Let's go ahead to bring in my Mewtwo and he decided to surrender after seeing my Shadow Mewtwo. Okay, so um, that's that, man. That's how scary Shadow Mewtwo is. Actually, he did not surrender after he saw the Mewtwo. He surrendered after the Draco Meteor landed. But <coughs> it seemed as if he surrendered after he saw the Shadow Mewtwo. So that's how scary Shadow Mewtwo is, man. Anyway, we got matched up against our next opponent. Really, let's see who we got matched up with. Hey, I don't know how to pronounce her. Something more, something numbers. Alright, so we got, we got a mirror match over here. Dialgear versus Dialgear. Let's see uh, what happens right now. Uh, his Dialgear is at 4140. It means I have a slight advantage over him because my Dialgear is level 50. Alright, so uh, let's see if he's going to use his Iron Head or not. Okay, he's not. I'm going to use my Iron Head though. Let's see if he's going to use his Draco. Meteor may or may not be, but I'm just gonna hope it's not Draco Meteor. We're gonna go with Iron Head. We're gonna try and farm down. Uh, thinking, 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 thinking. We wanna shoot these guys. Thinking, oh no, what? I'm gonna shoot just to be safe. Draco Meteor is ready, and it is Draco Meteor. All right, good. We're gonna farm down the DL gear now. All right, nice, nice, nice. And we are one shoot down, but it's totally fine because we have switch advantage. So let's see what he has. It's another Mewtwo, man. I told you guys, everybody is gonna use Mewtwo. Everybody is using Mewtwo. Everybody is using Mewtwo because Mewtwo is in raids right now. So I guess everybody likes to use Mewtwo and can use Mewtwo right now. Alright. 
So um, that uh, did nothing because uh, he went to shield against the Iron Head, but Dragon ba Breath, Dragon Bath. Yep, so sorry guys, I'm not, not sure what's wrong with my mouth today, right? Uh -huh. It's okay, um, not to worry, okay? That almost took us out. Can I actually get to an Iron Head before we faint? And the answer is yes, thankfully, actually. Thinking about the switch into Giratina, but uh, maybe not. I do not want to lose the switch, so I'm gonna let him uh, psycho cut me down. I'm gonna bring in Giratina now, okay? Giratina can just uh, Shadow Claw down the Mewtwo, but I'm thinking I wanna shield this, and I think I'm gonna save the shield for the Shadow Mewtwo, because it's quite glassy because of its uh, shadow form, so I would rather save the shield for that. Okay, we can Shadow Body Garchomp once. Okay, let's go with that. I think I'm even not going to switch at all. I'm just going to play out with the uh, Giratina. Alright, yep, yep, that did good amount of damage. And uh, let's see now. I I mean, I could actually shoot the Giratina also if I wish to, but we are here to showcase Shadow Mew too, right? So I'm not going to shoot this at all. I mean, I could actually shoot to use Ominous Wind. Alright, I mean, that's great. Sentum, let's go ahead and bring in the Mew too right now. And we're going to go with Side Strike. Okay, I'm going to shoot up against everything. But, um,. Yep, look at it. This is gonna be insane, man. Alright, here we go. Let's excellent it. And it's gonna overkill the <laughs> Garchomp. Ouch! Alright, let's uh, see against the Mewtwo also. Okay. Twice. People uh, surrendered using their Mewtwo against the Shadow Mewtwo. That is just scary. Alright, to see Shadow Mewtwo. Especially when you have one shield left and uh, your opponent does not have any shield and you have your Shadow Mewtwo still. With you, oh my god, the damage is just devastating, especially from the side strike and even from the shadow ball or even focus blocks or anything from Mewtwo is just insane. The damage is just super duper high. So we got matched up against our next opponent already. Let's see who we got matched up with. Hopefully it's not um, like an arrow finding match or something like that. Uh, that would be nice. Uh, that's probably Missing No. Uh, if you guys do not know what Missing No is, Missing No is a Pokemon um, yep, arrow finding match. It's a Pokemon, technically, with the Pokedex number 000 in the main series game. It's a glitch Pokemon that you can uh, technically opt in, alright? And uh, it will actually uh, allow you to do some really amazing stuff with your items. So anyway, we got matched up against our Giratina uh, opponent, and it's a very good start for us. Let's see what's he gonna do. He's gonna switch into Mel Metal. Gonna switch into uh, Giratina for us. Okay, I tapped the switch once already. I'm not too sure why I didn't switch, but it's totally fine. Okay, so I'm gonna let this go through. It's gonna be a rock slide. It's totally fine. Actually, I could have tried to catch the superpower, but uh, it's fine. It's totally fine. Also, you know, Giratina is thick against the. Uh, Against the rock slide, so we are good. Okay, um, it's a level fifty Mel Metal though. It's a Hundo a four zero six nine, which I do not have at all because uh, I'm just too lazy to open the mystery box. By the way, if you guys are, you know, playing the mystery box and uh, it reduced to two days to cool down instead of three days, very good. And you can get yourself the shiny Mel Turn Mel Metal also. So um, try your luck to actually get it if you wish to get it. Alright, good. We landed the Shadow Ball. We are going to go with Ominous Win now. I'm not going to shoot the um, Rock Slide again, but if he is going to shield against the Ominous Win, I might shield against the next uh, Rock Slide just so that I get Switch Advantage. Alright, because I do not want the Giratina to uh, face up against my Mewtwo. Alright, yep, he shielded that. So he's bringing in uh, Giratina. Well, it's time to bring in the uh, Dialgia, then it's good then. Alright, Dragon Breath down the uh, the, uh, the Giratina. I'm gonna let this go through. Alright, even if it's a Shadow Ball, it's totally fine. My Iron Head is ready already. It's Ominous Win. Alright, uh, luckily I didn't shoot that though. Alright, we're gonna go with uh, Iron Head right now. And let's see if it's gonna shoot this or not. It's really down one shoe. I'm still up two shoes though. Alright, so it looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. And uh, okay, he's down two shoes. I'm up two shoes. Okay, we can just Dragon Breath down the Giratina. Thinking if I want to shield this though, I mean if it's a Shadow Ball, yes, I'll get taken out. But uh, I want to showcase Shadow Mewtwo, so I'm not going to shield at all. Alright. Yep, I mean I would have shielded that if I do not want to showcase a Shadow Mewtwo, but I mean, sure. I'm supposed to showcase Shadow Mewtwo, not showcase people quitting the game, so I'm so sorry guys. Okay, okay. Next battle. Alright. Maybe just, just let's use Shadow Mewtwo as the lead. 
No, I'm just kidding. Obviously, that's not going to happen. Um, it's not really good to use a Shadow Mewtwo as a lead because uh, I want to try and get rid of the shields first and preserve my shields with the other two Dragon Pokemon. Okay, this is going to be fun <coughs> for him because uh, his Landorus is very, very good against my uh, Dialgia with Superpower especially. Okay, I'm going to try and catch this Superpower, right? Not shielding this at all. Superpower me, please. Okay, cool. And it is Superpower. Alright, good. Let's see what's the next Pokemon. And it is Ivalto. Okay, very, very good for him, man. Very, very bad for me, man. Alright, so I'm going to go with Shadow Ball. That's the best move against uh, Ivalto. Now, since I do not have Dragon Pulse, usually I run Dragon Pulse, but um, I've decided to switch back into uh, using Double Ghost Charge move. And the Dark Pulse is going to come in soon. It's charging up a lot of energy. Probably preparing for my DLG to come in also. So, um, I'm going to let this go through. Not going to be able to survive that. Oh, can I? Oh, okay, wait, hang on. Can I actually get to another Shadow Ball? And the answer is yes. And now, what am I going to do? I'm going to bring in the DLG and I'm going to farm down the, uh, the Gerati, the, 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 the Yivalto. Okay. But, I probably need to double shield myself. Okay, but, um, let's see that. Okay, he's going to use his charge move. I mean, it's a Dark Pulse probably, but might be a Focus Blast also as he's ready. So, I don't want to take the risk. So, I'm going to go with my Iron Hit first. He's probably going to shield. Alright, this is very, very dicey, I must say. Very, very dicey. Alright, we talked down the Ivalto. Let's go ahead to see if he's going to bring in the... Landorus. He has two shoes left though, so um, that's something to take note of also. He has two shoes left. I'm going to try and Dragon Breath as much as I can. Okay, uh, Super Power is coming in. I'm going to shoot this. Yes, guys, I am down two shoes and he is up two shoes, which is very, very bad for us. Okay, so let's Dragon Breath as much as we can. I am not going to use my Charge Move against the Landorus. I think I can take it out with just Dragon Breaths alone before another Charge Move comes in after this. Uh, maybe not. Okay, yep, definitely not. Okay, so he's up two shoes, which is very bad for us. And he is bringing in a Mewtwo. Now it's my turn to run away. I would actually just top left right now because the Shadow Ball is going to take us out. But uh, for the sake of entertainment, let's see a boom. Oh my god, I just realized, guys, it's a Purified Mewtwo. That's very painful to see. But I mean, it's a level 51 uh, Hando Purified Mewtwo. But still, I would not Purify a Shadow Mewtwo at all because it's still stronger than a non-Shadow um, Mewtwo. So, ouch. That was painful to see, as in uh, not my Mewtwo fainting, but seeing a Purified Legendary Pokemon. Every time it hurts me to see a Purified Legendary Pokemon because... Oh, okay. It's okay. It's fine. It, 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 it's always uh, other people's choice, not mine. Anyway, th this guy's name is quite interesting. Aaron! Alright. Oh, he's using a Shadow Mewtwo also. By the way, Aaron is uh, the name of my younger brother. And um, very nice to see that it's a very... It, it, it's what this guy's name is. name is uh, Avatar. So, Alright, so I'm going to go with Iron Head first. This probably would KO the Mewtwo already since it's already down to like under 50% health but uh, definitely it's going to shield it okay I mean if it's a focus blast I'm dead if it's a shadow ball it's going to deal a lot of damage so if it's a side strike it's still going to do a lot of damage but that's going to one hit KO us so luckily I shielded that good alright bringing in a DL gear so I don't really have an answer against a DL gear other than my very own DL gear also so I am going to charge up to almost um, okay it's an iron hit I was going to say, I was going to charge up the almost Draco Meteor and then fire off the uh, Iron Head to try and see if I can bait the shield. Alright, we're going to... Oh, you know what? Let's go with Draco Meteor now. Oh, you know what? No, we should have gone with Iron Head. I'm a dummy. Too much irons in my head, man. Oh, okay, that was so stupid. Alright, well, that, yep, that was a... That was... That, that, that was stupid. Yep, stop talking, Brandon. Shut up. Next time, shut up. Stop talking, okay? Stop talking. Okay, we're going to go with Side Strike. Hopefully, this is enough to take out the uh, Dialgia. Alright, if it's not, then we're going to go with another Side Strike. But the problem is another Iron Head is going to come in first. Shush! Alright, should have tapped on the Iron Head and stop trying to tap on the D on the, the Draco Meteor. Alright, Draco Meteor. Oh, my god. Alright, so uh, one more Side Strike should be enough to take out the Dialgia. Alright. Let's see what's he going to bring in though. <laughs> Alright. And it is going to be his next Pokemon now. Let's see, let's see. If he's bringing a Mewtwo, I'm bringing in Giratina straight. 
because he has focus blast right okay he has focus blast but uh, it's still gonna take my Mewtwo out okay 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 I'm oh well 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 thank you I guess thank you right uh, because he has focus blast so it will not one shot my uh, Mewtwo unless he has shadow ball and focus blast which is kind of um, rare to see Okay, I can get to another move already. Okay, I can't get to another move, but I've done whatever damage that I can to the Garachomp already. We're gonna bring in the... We're gonna bring in the... The Giratina. And uh, Shadow Claw down the uh, Garachomp. Or should we Ominous win it? Okay, we're gonna Ominous win. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no, 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 I tapped on it already, oh no, oh no, oh no, the Mewtwo has energy, oh no, 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 nope, I can't get to Ominous Wind, I need to get to Ominous Wind, but the Mewtwo just needs one more Psycho card, yep, I knew it. If I did not tap on the Ominous Wind, probably I could have just uh, Shadow Claw down the uh, Garchomp and then... Uh, no, wait, I was... No, uh, yeah, yeah, I, I, I would have been able to get to my Charge Move because the Charge Move wasn't ready for the Shadow Mewtwo. But... That was crazy. <laughs> yeah, I made a mistake. Shouldn't have tapped on the Ominous Wind. Yep, I think that is all that I have to show to you guys in terms of how uh, Shadow Mewtwo performs. It's a very, very crazy and uh, super duper high damage uh, Pokemon. However, it's really, really glassy, but a uh, wing can you please stay in the ball? Alright, so... It's a very, very uh, high damage dealing uh, Pokemon, but it also suffers a lot more damage, but... Uh, yep, I definitely could have won the last one, like, relatively easily if I actually paid more attention. And especially if I use my Iron Head also at the same time. So that was a really huge, mis big mistake on my part, but it's totally fine. So yep, hopefully you guys have enjoyed watching me show you guys how Shadow Mewtwo, level 50 Shadow Mewtwo performs in the Master League. It's a very, very strong Pokemon to use. Especially when your Pokemon, your opponent runs out of shields and you're still up basically one shield at least. You can take out virtually any team. Um, other than maybe Yvalto or Zarud, if you do not have Focus Blast. Yeah, I think. Alright, so um, if you guys enjoyed this video, definitely leave a like on the video. It'd be much appreciated. Thank you very much. And I'll see you guys in the next episode in the next video. Mewtwo, it's time to say goodbye. But not forever. I mean, I'll prefer using the non-shadow one. So um, I'll see you next year, maybe. Alright, next year. Alright, so goodbye, goodbye, goodbye.